If you want to capture game footage into the ATEM Studio in 1080p from a 4K source, then watch this video. When I first started capturing game footage from the PC, I was mirroring directly into the HDMI input of the Blackmagic ATEM Studio and using OBS to downscale the 2K video to the 1080p mirrored image. I purchased the GoFranco Prophecy 4K HDR 1x2 splitter. It splits one source device to two displays up to 4K at 60Hz. It's compliant with HDMI 2.0a, HDCP 2.2 and 1.4 with 18 gigabits per second bandwidth. It also has intelligent downscaling that detects and configures the video resolution automatically according to the capabilities of each connected monitor. This means you can game in 4K or even 2K while capturing gameplay in the ATEM Studio or your recorder of choice in 1080p. I used the ATEM Studio as a hardware switcher to stream to live to YouTube using the Webcaster X2. For more details on that, see the description or the card above. The downside to the software approach is that I have to have OBS started before I can start playing a game. The other con was that it took processing power to run that additional executable, and it also took a 20 frames per second hit on gameplay performance in 2K. Although this is a 4K 60p scaler, it handles 2K 165Hz footage fine. You're just limited to 60p. The primary benefit of the Prophecy Splitter is that it offloads the scaling and the CPU hit to the scaler. The only downside is that there is some screen tearing on fast pan movements as seen here. The packaging is pretty simple. It comes with a manual where you can review any of the settings for the dip switches, and since it's so simple, I didn't even bother changing those. Next is the splitter, which is made of aluminum and all the connections are nice and snug. Here's the five volt, two amp power adapter. My ASUS monitor is connected to the NVIDIA Titan X graphics card via display port. I then take the HDMI output from the graphics card and plug it into the HDMI in of the splitter. I then went into the NVIDIA graphics control panel to check the settings. Make sure that the image is mirrored in the setup multiple display section. The ASUS display is at 2560 by 1440 for its native resolution at 165 Hertz. The HDMI splitter is mirrored at the same resolution. If that didn't make sense, here's a schematic of the connections. The footage I used here is from my kids playing Fortnite. I added a link to their channel in the description if you're interested. Overall, I highly recommend this splitter for anyone trying to simplify the recording setup without having to go through setting up OBS prior to starting a game. If you're interested in streaming multicam setups, please consider subscribing to my channel. Please do me a favor and hit the like or dislike with some constructive criticism if you wish. Everything I talked about in terms of links are in the description below and thanks for watching.